So what is up guys, I am 63 8 and this is obviously Counter-Strike Global Defense, but hold up, I need to change something. Okay, I'm back, tell me if you can spot what's, what was changed. Um, so I'm actually on CSGO, I'm waiting for Maddie to finish, to have a half an hour break before dance so I can record one summer video, one more summer video, and then hop on the Star Wars Battlefront beta again. Um, I've actually got decent internet, but I'm going to get all internet in like a little minute. Hopefully when I'm actually doing good so you don't see me going shit. But what's happening as of late is the past three or so weeks have not been very good for me. Like a month and a half ago, internet went down. We had to get an internet technician out. So we had to get everything kind of reorganized, kind of re-looked through for our internet kind of thing. A month and a half ago, internet went out. So we had to get internet technicians all out to try and fuck, try and kind of fix it all. Um, so all the internet was going good again. It was all going fairly well. You know, we thought it was all fixed, and it was actually getting decent internet for my area, right? Um, then about a week ago, not a week ago, three weeks ago, because um, I, I, I was leading up to my birthday and I had a lot of preparations for around my house so I could actually have my birthday party, which I talked about in a previous video. Maddie had helped me a lot, so I said, you know, I'll stay around your house for the next coming two to three weeks to make up for it kind of thing. It's not fair to make her always come to my house, right? So. I stayed around at her house, but previous times I've been at her house, I've just been... The fuck? Anyway, so I had to, I stayed around her house. So anyway, I stayed around her house and I actually got hospitalized, which I, talk in, which I talked in another video as well, not very deep, but I did actually talk about it. I, got, I actually got sent to hospital for the night because of um, breathing problems and chest problems as well, which they thought of could have been something worse than it was. They didn't actually, they took a whole bunch of tests, but they couldn't figure out anything that was actually wrong while I was there. I always get taken out by bots. I can kill everyone else, but I get taken out by bots. I actually got hospitalized. I got hospitalized for five hours in the, um, from about one in the morning till about, uh, 5.36ish. So yeah, it was a, fa it was a fairly long-ish time, kind of. far. Like, I don't usually spend time in hospital, especially for myself. Like, fuck me. I don't usually spend time in the hospital, especially for myself. I'm usually healthy. Fuck off. I'm usually a fairly healthy person, right? Oh, shit, everyone keeps making me think someone's gonna fucking try and kill me. Oh. I was in there for about five hours. They couldn't figure out what was wrong with me, so they discharged me from the emergency unit, and I went home with a whole doctor's thing to take to my doctor later on when I actually saw him next, which, you know, I, I did obviously because, you know, I'm not going to fucking let myself die. Like, Jesus. Fucking die, motherfucker. Oh no, got another guy, another guy, another guy, another guy. Fuck off. I was in hosp- Fuck. I was in hospital for five hours, five and a half hours, and they couldn't figure out what's wrong with me, so they discharged me from the emergency unit, yeah? So I went to my GP, which is, for anyone who doesn't know, a general practitioner who dabbles in, like, everything, kind of. They're, like, your doctors that used to see as little kids, if you've had a cold or something like that, or they're the starting stages for anything that could be big. Oh, fuck me, connection's gone bad. Why is connection gone bad? Look at it, it's just skyrocketing. Once I came home, I went to the GP, and I had a whole bunch more tests done on me to see what it could be, and they couldn't figure out what was wrong with me either. It was down to three things. It wasn't anything... anything Fuck off. Wasn't anything in particular again. It was just, you know, just three things. And I'll get into that in a sec. Just hold on. They said it could be something to do with the gallbladder, could have been a lung infection, or it could have been asthma. So, after a about a week or so of having to deal with this, they pinned it to asthma. So now I actually have four different inhalers. So I've got four different inhalers, um, and I have scripts for more if I actually run out anytime soon. Um, that's what happened then, and that like kind of didn't really affect me too much, but it was kind of like, wow, I've never actually had anything like that in my family before. So it's it's weird for me to have it, especially like realizing I have it at such a late age. A week and a half ago, actually, um, my internet went down again. It was going at like 36 kilobytes a second at max. And for those of you who know internet, you know that's like really shit. Like right now, this connection to anyone would just piss them off. But to me, fuck, that's high. 
But to me, it's actually fairly normal to have this kind of shitty connection. Well, not this kind of a shitty connection. I'm used to like 60, not 150. See, look at that. 301. I, they've pinned it to asthma, and that's what I've gotten. But then a week and a half ago, my internet went down again. It went really freaking slow. Like, really, really, really goddamn slow. Which means I had to get another technician out in less than two months. I've now had my internet fixed again. It's going a little bit faster. I've gotten some wires replaced that the other guy I didn't realize had been, like, messed up a bit. So now we've got a bit better internet at times, but still not that good. That's why I couldn't upload for about a week straight. Like, I had no internet. I couldn't even use, watch YouTube or anything like that. The only internet I had was at my um, my school place, which is what I go for for my, for my diplomas, which I've also talked about in another video before. Fuck me, I'm just not even going to worry about it. I'm going to wait till the game ends, because I'm just going to keep dying. only kind of internet I had was actually at my... Um, ooh! Oh, no way, I just got a new gun. I'm fine for that. Get the fuck out. But then, as of two days ago, one of the people I went to high school with, called Sam Holty, he was on the... He got put on the news for this. He was put in a motorcycle on motorcycle accident, and he died about an hour afterwards. I was actually at a party when I found out, and it managed to circulate, circulate its way around, and it all just kind of died off, never went home because of it. It was just... It kind of just made the night go a bit southish for a lot of people, not for everyone, but for most people, like Maddie and a couple other people that were there. But that's really why I haven't been uploading. I didn't upload for so many. That's because of the internet. But as I felt like I had to fill everyone in, and I thought I'd take this time while I'm waiting for Maddie to do this, so I could play a quick game of Counter Strike. I'm actually glad I did because I got another ump. Um, play a quick game of this before I. Talk to her for about half an hour while before she does a dance thing, and I'll be playing for about 40 minutes on Soma, and then I'll play the rest of the night on Star Wars, which is actually so fucking good. I did such a good game. Like the balance for that, for the 2020 ATATs is so shit. If you're a rebel, you have like no chance of winning. Basically, I've played that I've played that game mode that many times. And last night, I was so, I like messaged Maddie so many times saying, oh, I fucking, I did it, I did it, I did it. And we had won, just, because it was my, all, I had actually gotten an orbital strike on one of the AT-80s, and I fucked it up. And then in the last 10 seconds, ev everyone shot, no matter if they were getting killed or not, they just went straight at the other AT-80, and it just got demolished. And it was so close, I'll actually upload that in its own separate video, just the whole gameplay, no cuts or anything like that, so you'll see how many times I died. People need to stop being yelling in the lounge. Great English. Um, and you guys can all see that. I'm actually, I've am i already scheduled about three or four weeks worth of videos. So by the time you see this, it's either I've uploaded it early or I've pushed this back. Fucking hell, Emmy. Or I've pushed them all back or I've pushed this video back. But I'll probably release this pretty soon because I want to actually... Um, I want to... I have a lot of raw beta footage from like three different games like Black Ops 3. I've got a bunch of games I need to go through, get any sniper clips out and find any good gameplays that I can just upload as a whole video itself. And then also go through my Rainbow Six Siege footage which is also the Ubisoft's new waiting simulator game. I spent like 10 hours waiting for games overall. Over like two days worth of playing. Which is a long time. A really long time. Probably played about just about five hours more, like 15 hours on actual game time and 10 hours on waiting time. Pissed me off so bad. Um, and then I've also got the Star Wars footage I played the second day it came out because I was actually meant to get a closed beta code um, but then I didn't actually get one because I, I was meant to get one I was meant to get it when everyone else got their closed beta codes but no I had to actually wait in the end till the open beta came out so I had to play it when everyone else played it sadly so I'm playing it with everyone else but I actually should have a better connection and then I'll be uploading all that kind of stuff in a little while so sorry in the last couple minutes hasn't been all too much gameplay it's been more just me talking um, but I kind of kind of count this as like a vlog kind of thing, but I kind of don't at the same time. Like this game is really fun. Um, I don't like having to spend money on cases, and it pisses me off because I actually want to have at least one or two really good guns. But you know, it costs money, and all I can get is these stupid like blue ones. Yeah, the, this one was actually given to me like the sump was, so I'm kind of happy about it. Because I use these all the time. I love them. I love my dual barrettas. But anyway, so that's everything that's been happening. It's been a pretty hard month, a month and a half. Like the internet doesn't like stack up with someone dying or me getting asthma. Like 
obvious, like, it was, it's pretty bad that, like, Sam died. So I was really good friends with him. I'd been friends with him all throughout year 8 and year 9. Probably would have just seen a cut there. My actual outro just finished. Um, like, it got cut off about, like, three minutes early, that kind of thing. But it doesn't really stack up to what's happened in the past month and a half. Like, it's all been bad and it's been pretty harsh, but it's just what's happened. So, I can't really move past it any further than I already am, but I'm, I'm hoping everything kind of gets better. I'm hoping things die down and go my way a bit more. I've got some videos stacked up, so hopefully you'll see this before I act, before um, all my other videos. Because a whole bunch of videos stacked up, and I was actually going to talk about this in the Star Wars video, but that I was just about to do, but I want to do something while I waited for Maddie, and it's already past the time, which is probably going to get annoyed at me for not talking straight away, but thank you guys for watching. Anyone who stuck around for the very long outro, thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe, and if you want to hear more of the story that I was actually about to finish, I'll tell in the Star Wars video that should be coming out soonish. And thank you guys for watching. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Here we go. Here we go.